pretty much show my emotions. This is my first video, so I don't have an introduction video or anything like that. This is just a raw, um, a raw video of my true emotions right now. Um, so I'm out, well, my husband is out now getting my, um, liquids and, um, so I can prepare for tomorrow. And, um, I was very, very excited and, um, just, it's just a surreal moment something that you thought about for years like over over 10 years contemplating to do this surgery or not and through the years technology has gotten better and um life has happened to where it became um um more um uh, adamant that or more i don't even know the right word for it but it's just the right time now but at this very moment, I'm actually feeling um, like I want to cry. Um, not a fear of the surgery, because I'm not scared of the surgery at all. I know I've had three children, so I'm really not worried about that at all. <laughs> um, I'm sad and, um, and it's hard for me to really place the emotion. Um I know it's going to be hard two weeks and really it's almost like a month um, without food. Um, When you spent your whole, pretty much your whole life being overweight, you have a relationship with food that you don't really realize that you have until you make the decision to take that part of um, dependency away from yourself. And you have to begin to make a new um healthy choice for yourself and build a new relationship with yourself to where food is not a handicap anymore. And I'm choosing this um, surgery because it's a tool to help me fight against what I've always depended on for comfort. So that being said, I wanted to videotape because it's hard for me to articulate what I'm feeling right now because I don't want it to seem like I'm sad or scared about this surgery because I'm not I'm actually extremely excited it don't look like it but I am I'm just having a separation or a grieving Part of um, what I know would never, ever be the same for me. And that's a comfort that has been there forever. And I'm ready to embark on something that is totally, totally life-changing. And um, I was mad at myself because in January, I was at my heaviest which was 386.6 and in May um, I went to the doctor to talk to my doctor about having the surgery and I had lost uh, um, some weight and went down to 377.6 and so my doctor was like um, he wanted me to lose 37 pounds before surgery um, and I did not do that. So at this very moment, I have not weighed myself again. I will weigh myself tomorrow when I start my, um, my liquids. And I don't want to get on it before then because I'm already crying. 
because I can't change or undo what I did not do. And will that change my surgery outcome or um, I don't recall him saying it was a requirement. It was more so something that he wanted me to do that would help me um, in my process of losing weight to see if I'm able or capable of the discipline portion and to follow through with instruction. I think it was more so of that than a requirement. I don't know. I'm not putting too much thought in that anymore because I can't. Um, as you can see, I'm now here for vanity reasons. Um, I'm just coming to you the way that I am. I am Shalita. Again, I've told you my stats. I don't know um, my weight. I hope it's not back at my highest. But um, I will document that on tomorrow when I begin um, the journey. Um, my pre-op liquid diet journey. I will come back and videotape the haul of what uh, products I purchased for that. And here we go to all my weight loss um, community group, family, and friends. Um, thank you guys for your support. Uh, thank you for posting your journeys that have become like, <laughs> I just go over it over and over and over again to see you guys strength and um just being um uplifted so hello everybody i hope you all had a great thanksgiving i did um i really did i had a great time with my family and um and i'll tell you more details about myself later but with me watching videos i know what i came on the different channels to see and that was raw and uncut truth about the real um emotions that you endure and i did not document all of my visits and things like that because a visit is a visit but um right now the day before my pre-op liquid diet two weeks liquid diet is a real moment for me so i wanted to document it and share okay see you guys soon again i will document more and we are now all on the losers bench okay take care bye